the 10 years I was in San Joaquin County was worse for me than even my experiences with the NFL. So what's so bad about what is occurring at our coroner's division is that we have the top law enforcement official in the county. He's, he's deciding that he's going to be the one that determines what the facts are of the case instead of letting the facts speak for themselves. And this is the top law enforcement official in the county that has decided that he is not going to listen to a guy like Dr. Amalo a guy who is world famous for his integrity, a guy who took on the NFL about concussions, and they came at him from every different direction to prove that he was not honest, and they couldn't do it. This is an honest guy who just finally said, hey, enough's enough. First and foremost, we are public servants. We're public servants. We're answerable to the people. We are not above the people. The people are not beneath us. But what I saw was that some people are uh, beginning to place themselves above the people, believing they are not answerable to the people, that the county is their own fiefdom, that they're like the king or whatever, and are free to do whatever they want to do because they are elected. If we don't have honesty in law enforcement, we don't have anything. So the moment that we start changing what the facts are or what the evidence points to, we will never regain the public's trust. The 10 years I was in San Joaquin County was worse for me than even my experiences with the NFL. The NFL never dehumanized me. They never took my dignity away from me. Steve Moore did. In law enforcement, we have to be honest, we have to be truthful, and I'm not gonna allow you to lie to the citizens of San Joaquin County. I'm gonna stand up, even if it costs me my job, and say, look, the integrity of the investigation has to stand on its own. Pat Wichro called me, I, so I said he read what is going on, that you know what, having read my memos and Dr. Parsons' memos, that he thinks the officers should be separated that there is an inherent conflict of interest um, and that he wants to serve the public. That if he wins and he brings about change, would I be willing to come back in whatever capacity to continue serving the people of the county? I said, sure, why not? Why not? My name is Pat Withrow and I'm running for sheriff in San Joaquin County and I would love to have your vote.